and welcome everyone to another exciting episode of the Super Carlin Gaming Pokemon Legends Arceus Nuzlocke Challenge, where in today's episode, we still have to get to our uh, next research level, so we're going to be doing some fun exploring around uh, the beach. We're back at the beach, looking and see a time-space distortion over there, and look, I found this lovely place on the map called... Uh, what? Did... Oh, wait. Now I can't see the title. I think it was called Turnback Cave, <laughs> is what it's called. So I was like, hey, that sounds like somewhere we should definitely go. So we're gonna go there, and maybe we're gonna catch some other stuff along the way. Uh, also, in case you forgot, we got a shiny! There's our shiny Cricketoon, Barb, who of course we're rocking with on the team today. Uh, we are set up at this camp over here. Uh, let's give a quick rundown of what the team is looking right now. We still have Luisa, Nice, Ritera, Humphreys, Barb, and Stone the Gabite. We got a couple of dragons on the team. I don't see how we can get around doing that. You know, drag. we love dragons on this team. We big, big dragon energy over here. And then of course, there's really no way not to have Barb on the team either. I mean, level 24, maybe not the best level you could, uh, ask for, but we're just going to be getting experience today. You know, we're just going to get experience. That's our goal um, and to get the next research task. So there's that. Also though, while we're here, someone pointed out to me that our Silcoon does not have a nickname. What? So we're going to change the name of Silcoon here to the very person who pointed it out to me, which was Hunter in the comments. So there you go. Thank you, Hunter. Silcoon is now Hunter. Boom, probably not gonna get a lot of action. So some exciting things happen if and when we can get to the next star level. One, we should be able to use Pokemon higher than level 50, which is fantastic because then we can use, finally, Mercury again and Lasagna, which would be awesome. Uh, not that we don't already have a freaking awesome looking team over here. We have so many options, so many options this time around, which is fantastic. I have a feeling like we're just gonna like level these guys out of use in a second here. And if we do that, we're probably gonna have to lean on Hot Chalk and Storm here to come in and maybe just do some battles for us. Not that I think we have any super big battles or anything today, but just so that we're not getting like lied to. Oh, look at, look at Neo, a glorious Parasect. Oh my gosh, so much fun, it's such fun. Hey, what's up, Barb? There's Barb, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Oh, look, okay, is that, okay, so obviously our goal is gonna be just catch lots of stuff. Oh, is that how it be? Is that how it's gonna be, Drifloom? Okay, well, we s oh! Obviously that didn't work. Uh, we're not gonna fight with, oh, okay, you know what? I don't wanna fight the Alpha, though. We're just gonna go over here. Let's see, I wanna catch some of these ghosts, because I feel like that'll be an easy way to start just getting some catches in on the day, but we gotta be a little bit stealthier about it. Oh gosh, we are not doing a good job. <sighs> All right, this guy's going down, right? We're just gonna have Rotera wreck this guy. No problem. See you later, Dusclops. See you later, friend. Yeah, you've been dark pulsed into oblivion. You're dead, you're dead. All right, good, 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 good. Now maybe we can actually catch some stuff. I'm gonna grab this caster fern here. We're just gonna be real sneaky, real sneaky lack. That thing's gonna pop up again, and it's about to get caught. Oh, what happened? What? You dare! Oh my gosh, that's so annoying. That hit us just as we were throwing it. Oh my gosh, it's so annoying. I just want to get <laughs> away from everything so I can actually. Here we go. All right, are we are we still under attack from something? Oh! Oh, it wants to fight. This drift blim wants to fight, y'all. All right, it's going down. You wanna fight both? You wanna fight it? No one wants to fight Rotera. That's a bad move on your part because you're going down in one shot. But at least then we'll be able to successfully <laughs> get some other stuff going here. You trying to astonish me, man? I consider myself not astonished. Look at that. We're not hiding. Don't it looks it looks maybe like we're hiding behind that rock. We are not afraid of this dumb balloon. Okay? We don't fear balloons. Has to be said. Alright, here we go. Grab this medicinal leak, and now we are actually gonna start catching stuff. 
like that dust skull right there. Except it looks like he's behind a tree branch, which I didn't throw anything about this game. That tree branch doesn't look big, but I guarantee it was in our way. Oh no, come on, man. Get him the ball. Oh, we got it. Thank goodness. All right, so we obviously can't keep that. We've already caught something over here. So not the best situation. There we go, free experience. Oh my gosh, the ghosts, they see everything. They see you. What a spoopy place we're in. Oh my gosh, there's a giant Duskmar over there. All right, you know what? This is not the place. <laughs> this is not the place. This is what I have determined. We're gonna go somewhere else. Maybe we'll go to that time-space distortion over there. We can still catch stuff in the water, I believe, right? Well, forget that mantine, I guess, or that mantike. Maybe we can get that basculin. Or maybe not. Why are we, why is that not working? That's weird. Ah, they're running away. They're noticing us. This is the problem. All right, get it, Rotera. Stardust. Oh, just, I thought that was gonna have a Pokemon in it. That was dumb. It does not. Look at that time-space distortion. I wonder if we can catch anything over there. Actually, <laughs> you know where I think we are. Perhaps it is time to visit an old friend, my friends. Now, if I look at the map, did we catch something right over here? Windbreak stand, nothing. Castaway shore, nothing. This is for Veilstone Cap. Castaway shore, right? Ginkgo Landing, looks like we got something. I feel like Veilstone Cap is where we caught something though. I don't know which one this is going for. Hmm. Hmm. I feel like we are not making swift progress at all in today's episode. It's okay, it's all right. We just have to get some progress. Oh gosh, there's so many ghosts out here in the water. I feel like I should have gone for daylight. Oh uh, yeah. yeah, there's the Murkrow. Ginkgo Landing. Oh my gosh, everything is spotting us from so far away. I just want to sneak up on stuff and catch it without being bothered. All right, it's going down. We're just gonna fight it with Nice here. We'll see how good you feel about this uh, decision to fight to fight nice, Murkrow. Suspicion, you're not going to have been happy. Yeah, that's what I thought. You defeated Murkrow, no problem. Easy. Remember you defeated rock type move. There's just ghosts everywhere. And they shouldn't be that hard to defeat, honestly. What is that sparkling thing over there? Is that like just a rock? What is that? Are you see it? I need to go investigate that. That looks, why is it sparkling so much? It's not like a shiny Pokemon, is it? Like, what is that? Oh, it's just rocks. Oh my gosh, how boring. I thought we were about to find something like really cool, but instead we didn't. All right, oh, <laughs> look what it is, you guys. It's the Drapion, the return of the Drapion. Oh, dearie me. Deary, deary me. Okay, let's see. Let's see. <laughs> a time space misfortune appeared. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. Did we catch something here? I feel like we didn't. I feel like we left it. Oh, there's another alpha over there. It's the alpha. Is this double alpha zone? Oh my gosh. It totally is. Well, we don't want to catch that though, because if we catch it, then then that's that, right? We're just gonna have to clear them out. We're gonna have to clear them out. Let's go. Return of the fight. I wonder how strong that thing is. If it's like level 50 or something, that'd be bad, but we could probably take it at this point. Now that Nice is so strong, so defensive. All right, Scaruppy number one is dead. Oh, there's two of them. There's two of them. What do we have in bag? Did it like the honey? Did it like honey? I forget. I forget what we were using last time. I think it was honey though. Um, Let's see, let's see. We have some honey and then we have, 
the stealth stuff as well. Let's see if we can attract it over. Oh. Oh, it's coming. Is it coming? Does it see it? Does it want that honey? Oh, it wants it. Now we have the leaden balls. That's what we have with us this time. Can we do it? Can we do it? Can we do it? Oh, come on! Do it! Catch it! <gasps> no! <laughs> hey, remember when we spent a whole episode trying to do that? Come on. Oh my gosh. <laughs> We've gotten so close. We've gotten so close so many times. I can't believe the number of back tries we've gotten on this thing. We just can't get to stay in the ball. Oh. <laughs> oh, we got it. Oh, we got it. Oh my gosh. Get out of the way, Skaruppy. You don't even know. Oh, I am your god now, as far as I can know. We have an alpha Pokemon. You guys are gonna have to tell me whether or not, I, I can't even remember if I ended up catching something else. I'm not releasing that at the moment though, <laughs> not yet. Oh my gosh, what a wonderful feeling. Oh, finally caught the Drapion with a single attack. We used, look at this guy, he wants some, man. He's going down. All right, get out of here, Skruppy. Oh, the Drapion! Alpha Drape. Alpha Drapion. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna have to go back and check the tape. I don't even remember, because I don't think we caught anything over here. Go for Eevee. Oh! We got it! Oh! The hunt! The long hunt. If we did, it's almost gonna be a bummer. We should have just left it. We should have known we could come back later. How did this thing survive? It's impressive. You're a strong one. You're a strong one. I'll give you that. Number 21 to 25 defeated. Yeah, because we had to defeat so many just to get, um, <laughs> just to try and catch it that last time when we continuously failed. Oh my gosh. This guy looks like he wants to be caught, doesn't he? It's like, hey, 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 how about a quick catch? Yeah, Tangela caught, easy. First one. All right, let's see, that was a research task in and of itself. Let's see if we can catch this thing. Boom, come on, Motham, get in the ball. One shot, oh, with the catch! That's another research task as well, so there we go. Oh, it's two research tasks. This is working out nicely. This is working out nicely. Yo, come on, cat it, get it. You'd think we get something for catching an alpha too. That should be some sort of research task, right? Like caught an alpha Pokemon? Oh, come on. All right, you're gone, you're dead to me. Don't care, don't care. Actually, while we're here though, let's fight. Let's fight this one. Am I crazy or are we, at, or should we, should we, is nice not gonna listen? Oh gosh, I almost, I almost walked off my treadmill. Whew. Filled with wild might, used rest. Okay, what a waste of attack. All right, here we go. We're just gonna bulldoze this thing right into next September. Boom, boom, boom. Oh man, and we get to go twice? Yeah, it's dead. One shot, or two shot, one kill, boom. Knocked out the alpha, means we're gonna get some EXP candies as well. Get out of the way, you're going down too. I thought I didn't think they were gonna listen to us after level 50, or maybe we just have like better friendship or something. Can I have Mercury on the team is what I'm wondering, because <laughs> nice is level 51, we're not having any problems. Look at that time-space distortion up there. Hmm. Number you defeat with rock type moves, that's another lovely little bit of Research task, that's done. Here we go, now we can just sneasel our way up here, because now we can do this. Which means we can go to the turn back cave. Let's go. Let's go! Windbreak stand. Mm-hmm, oh yeah, we're, oh look, a Parasect. Oh, fun, oh, double Parasect. We only have one Great Ball left. That doesn't seem good, does it? The distortion faded. Hmm. 
Oh, what? That thing's mad at us from all the way down there? What kind of eyesight does that mushroom have? Really good eye shot, apparently. Apparently. Okay, so we're just gonna not deal with it then. We're just gonna continue on over to there. Because now we can access that area. Oh boy, we're gonna have to climb down a smidge. What? I don't know. I don't actually know spring path. Did we get something over here last time? I don't feel like we did. Now oh, there's a motham. Oh, it's a big motham. Okay, big moth, big moth. Where are we going? Up there? Where did we set our, oh, over 83, okay. We're just going over here. We wanna see what's in the cave. I feel like it's probably like dangerous things. So we'll be safe, you know. We're just gonna risk it. I don't know what's in there. Hopefully nothing too scary. Uh, let's see. It looks like a kind of important location. It looks like there's something you're supposed to find later. But you know, uh, whatever. Uh, this looks, not ominous at all. What's in here? Anything good? Ooh, turn back cave. All right. Oh, this is definitely where you fight like a legendary Pokemon later on. Okay. Boring. Can't do anything here. I think that's going to be like where you fight one of the lake spirits or something. Um, nothing in there right now. But that was such a, so anticlimactic. I thought we were really going to have something way better there. Is there any Pokemon over here at all that we can catch? No? Boy, that is, that is disappointing. All right, well, never mind. Never mind! <laughs> Don't need the Vivid Choke. That's just for reviving stuff, but of course we can't do that. Anything down here? Ooh, Piplups! Ooh, are we, have we caught something here? Where are we? We have definitely not been over here on the spring path. Ooh. Ooh, a Piplup, that sounds excellent. That sounds, ooh, a Toxicroak, okay, all right. We're gonna have to get sneaky all of a sudden, y'all. Let's get sneaky, because we want that Piplup right there. Ooh, yes, 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 yes. Apparently we only have one Great Ball, so that's not fantastic. Do we have any other, like, smoke bombs or anything like that? Nope! Nothing of the sort, hey? All right, no big deal. No big deal. We're just gonna sneak up real quiet like and we're not gonna be attacked by the toxic rogues. Oh, backstrike, let's go, come on, come on. Oh, just like that, the Piplup is caught. All right, that's gonna be exciting. That's exciting. Okay, all right, number of cops not being spotted. Another Bibarel over there. Maybe we can grab that real quick. We should be able to keep the Piplup though. That's our first catch in this area. Barb, do you want to do some uh, some berry picking there for us? That'd be tremendous. Oh, look at that guy. Now that looks dangerous. If I had to say, if I had to say. Oh yeah. Ah! Oh boy, he saw us. Well, let's fight it anyway. I think we can take it. Maybe. Oh wait, do these things sometimes have fighting type attacks? They sometimes do, but you know what? We have rock type attacks, and we are not going to miss, and we're just gonna knock it out in one shot. Ready, kablam! Yeah, like I said, no problem whatsoever. Yeah, number of feet of rock type moves. Yeah, okay, so that is looks like a very dangerous one, though. I'm not sure we wanna fight that alpha. That looks a little scarier. The cool thing is we got a Piplup. I'm excited about that. Ooh, Golducks, we can catch those things. We can catch those. Can we? Well, we need more great balls. That's the problem. We don't have enough stuff for great balls. Uh, craft? Do we? Oh, I guess we can make like five more. We need more iron chunks. Okay, that's good to know. If we see iron chunks, we'll have to uh, try and pick them up. We gotta get in this grass so this gold duck doesn't see us. Maybe we can just go one, two, three on these bad boys. Turn around, gold duck. Oh, are you kidding me? You saw me? I just disagree altogether. I, I disagree with your premise. It's all right, we got Luisa here. We'll take it down. It's got a really cool gem on its head. That's neat. Um, 
Crunch, I guess? I always feel like Golduck should be Psychic type. Also, like, I, I totally subscribe to the theory that somewhere, once upon a time, Golduck and Psyduck's, like, names just got, like, mixed up, right? Like, why isn't the yellow gold-colored duck called Golduck? And why isn't Psyduck the one with the psychic gem on its forehead, right? Like, someone messed up. That's what I'm saying. I don't know who, but like, they're, they're the wrong ones. <laughs> this should be Psyduck. And yet, no one's bothered by it. Oh, come on. <sighs> All right, we gotta fight this one too. They're too good at spotting us. It's really surprising. But what is Crunch it dead? It's got nothing. It's got nothing at all on Big Luisa. He spent, oh, it's got sleep. What's crazy about sleep in this game is it doesn't actually immediately make you asleep. Like you can still attack sometimes. Luisa's too drowsy to move, yep. You're not gonna make us more drowsy though. I don't think so. Crunch, go ahead for it. Nope, too drowsy, ugh. It's a headbutt, oh no, Luisa! Now I'm a little more nervous. Um, can we switch? Let's go to Rotera, yeah. Why be risky fighting this random wild gold duck, right? No reason to die. No reason to die doing something completely mundane like this. Oh, how dare you? How dare you? You dumb, not psychic duck. Oh my gosh, dark pulse this thing. We are not too drowsy to move. That does nothing. No effect. Yeah, maybe if you were a true psychic type. Nah, so it wouldn't matter. We defeated the gold duck, all right. Stupendous. Where's the other one? Look, how are they seeing us? What is attacking us? Oh gosh. I don't even see it. It's another gold duck? Jeez. Oh, and a Napoleon. All right, we're just getting out of here. All right, so I guess it makes sense the Empoleon's down there. That's scary. That's where the Piplups are there. Let's just see if we can go back to camp. And... Yeah, if we can go back to camp, maybe we have enough research tasks. I don't know. I don't feel like we caught a ton of, ton of stuff, but we didn't have a ton to do either. And we got a lovely alpha, right? Come on, it's gotta be worth something. Gotta be worth something. The important thing is, we got the Drapion. We proved we can do it. Mm -hmm. Most illuminating, yes indeed. Oh, we did it! Oh, yes! Oh, splendiferous result of death, so you earn yourself a promotion to the next rank. Uh, yeah. Return to village, let's go, see you later. We going. Time at long last to make it to the next spot. Oh my gosh, we did it. We did it. Flora Row, Main Street. Main Street. Flora Row. Here we go. Come on, Silene. Give us that upgrade. Rank me up. Let's go. We have to go release some stuff and have to go name some stuff. Silene. Yes, you've been progressing a research task. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yes, of course I did. Tremendous. All right, yeah, done with that. Level me up, dude. Mm, you have made progress. Seems to have earned yourself a star. I got a gold star. We did it! Yay, us. With this, you have officially attained the rank of fifth star in the Galaxy Expedition Team. Can I use wing balls? Pokemon up to level 65. Yes, all right. Oh, we'll need this for crafting, for the wing balls. Okay, cool, 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 cool. We need a lot of iron chunks, geez. Should go get some of those. It may not be an exaggeration to say that you might be the only one among the survey corps that can task with surveying the Alabaster Icelands. <gasps> oh yes, I remember what we were gonna go get. We were gonna go try and get the Zorua, the Zorua. Oh man, one of my favorite Pokemon from this gen. Absolute monster. Absolute monster. Total glass cannon, mind you, but one of the coolest designed Pokemon ever. Just ever. All right, first of all, let's go to get some crafting stuff here. We, at the very, I don't know if we can just buy more Pokeballs or something. Um, can I buy the iron chunks? Yeah. Woo. Oh, I can buy 190. That's probably too many. 
but we're gonna go way lower on that number. Maybe like, what do we add on like 75, you know? I know these are free. Let's just get like 60. Yeah, super. That seems good. All right, now let's go here and make some, like a bunch of these, right? We're gonna need a bunch. Now we're gonna make like 50. Yeah, that's what we want. That's what we wanted. Wing ball, I guess we should get a few of these. We got like five, just to be, just in case. Let's go ahead and make one of those. Always good to have a good smoke bomb on hand. Oh, hyper potion. Oh, there is a reason to have the Viva Chokes. Oh, that's good to know. I didn't know that. I might have been keeping them. Oops, I've been discarding them the whole game, thinking we did not need them. Um, well, that's my mistake, y'all. All right, whatever, whatever. No big deal, no big deal, no big deal. All right, let's go check out uh, the team as it stands right now. Oh my gosh, I'm so glad we got that, that drapey on, though. How amazing, how absolutely bonkers. Is it, can we see it walking around? Where is it? Where's my drapey on? Oh, there it is. Ah, oh, glorious, glorious. Reminds me of the mighty Zexen from back in the day. All right, so first of all, we gotta release a bunch of stuff um, for like this Motham. Absolutely getting out of here. You're gone. We gotta get rid of this Tangela. What, no, release. Yes, we gotta get rid of this. And now I don't remember whether or not we could keep this drapey on. So I'm just gonna, I'm gonna keep it right here for the time being. But man, at the moment, obviously we need to move Mercury onto the team. I'm leave it there for stone. Huh. We gotta give some names out as well. I'm gonna hold off on naming drapey on just yet, but yeah, let me know. Where, is this a legal catch? Is it a legal catch? I don't know. It's so fun that it's an alpha, but I can't remember if we're allowed to catch it. Uh, it's just been too long. <laughs> and my, my marker on the map is like off. It could be one place or another. So <clears throat> there we go. All right. I think that's the team we have to go with at the moment. Although we also forgot ah, lasagna, our dark poison type. Ugh. Well, see, we have the Rotera for dark. So at the moment, man, I was so pumped to use lasagna and now, uh, even though the strongest member of the team, hmm, I think we have to hold off at the moment. The other team members are just really good. We can't bench a shiny, obviously. That would be ridiculous. Um, and Humphreys, it'd be so cool to have just a nice, like, Hisuian Pokemon. Oh, but we've never used Slagoon. We love dragons, so such is the way. Here we go. We can't, we can't, we can't abandon Mercury either. I mean, Mercury's so good won us so many battles as well. Oh gosh, here comes Professor Laventon. Professor Weird Hat Man. Boy, I tell you guys what, it's a little bit colder outside, so I'm wearing jeans today on the treadmill. Not a great idea. Also, I forgot to switch into my walking shoes. I can feel it rubbing really bad in the shoes I've got going. Perhaps TMI. Yep, we're ready to the Alabasta Iceland, I see. Of course, we're all too aware the injury is done to some of our own good people because of the frenzies of all the nobles. Seem to be little choice but to intervene. But this Avalog out in Alabaster Iceland hasn't harmed a soul as I hear it. Does it really behoove us to get out of our way to subdue him? If Avalog's such a huge strong as they say, there's a good chance he can start an avalanche. Avalanche from Avalog. Yeah, that makes sense. Oh, we're putting Jay in danger of real harm. We don't know whether the frenzy truly are causing them to suffer, nor why they enter these states in the first place at all. Does it have to do something to do with a space-time rift? Okay, whatever, dude. I don't care. Let me go. Professor? Ah, nothing to bother yourselves about. Doubtless I'm just being a silly sausage. Yeah, I'll say. A silly sausage. Honing your battle skills. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna win. Um, let's go ahead and wreck our opponent here, Ray. Yeah, but I'm so glad I get to battle you. I owe a lot to you, you know. If you hadn't tumbled down to us, I might never learn to battle alongside Pikachu. Pikachu! How many does he have? Three? He better not be doing this nonsense where they send out like several Pokemon at once. A uh, Mr. Mine. Okay, all right, all right, all right. Luisa! Kick this guy's butt, man. All right, so Mr. Mime is like part fairy these days. Um, we're just gonna give it the old crunch 
Crunch and Maru. Part of me wants to like take a turn to just bulk up here. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Let's just bulk up real quick. We'll make Luis a nice and strong for the whole fight. Offensive stats are raised, defensive stats are raised. Boom! Calm mind, ah! Doing the same. The difference is we can hit for weakness. Basically, we both have the same move. No big deal, we're just gonna crunch this guy into the next world. Oh, we didn't quite get there. Hypnosis, how dare you? How dare you? I'm gonna go for it, I'm just going for the straight up crunch. Yeah, we got it, boom. Get that experience. We'll see, we'll see. Pikachu, obviously that was gonna happen. Uh, I knew he had Pikachu, you better not! <gasps> Oh my gosh, it's so annoying that they're allowed to just like swap in and like immediately attack. If this thing has like Iron Tail or something and knocks out nice, I'm gonna lose it. I'm gonna. <gasps> that is exactly 50%. Oh, dearie me. Okay, so we're gonna iron defense. Then there's no way he's got us. Because we know it does half, and iron defense will mean it does less than half, right? So we're gonna go iron defense. Let's see. Now we should get to go again, actually. And honestly, what we're gonna do, we should just attack. He can't kill us this turn. Because what we're gonna do is bulldoze this thing into the next century. Through the time space drift, yeah, you're dead. We didn't even need iron defense, that was just. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, that was annoying. Staravia, okay. We still, attack. does nothing, does nothing. No, this is doing nothing too. Yeah, I don't think so. Hit by the recoil, yeah. Hit yourself. Um, I'm pretty sure we can just win with a rock slide. My only concern is that it has close combat and that we miss with rock slide. I feel like it would've just opened with a close combat though because it had two attacks in a row. So let's just go, let's go rock slide here. Yeah, that's game, no doubt. Yeah, we got it, okay. Iron tail. Iron tail, that, what a cheat, man. What a cheat. Why would he have used iron tail against Luisa? That made any sense. He should have used Thunderbolt again. Uh, like, the, like, does the game playing prediction on me? The game doesn't predict. That was not cool. Are we still damaged? No, we're better. All right. Wow. Rival battle for the scare. Alabaster Iceland. Let's go. Can't believe that. That was that was that was a dirty by our old friend there. So we should have left with Mercury, maybe, because we could have taken easily the Pikachu, easily the Staravia, and I think we could have crunched the Mr. Mime, too. So yeah, Mercury would have been a really good lead against Ray. Um, Alabaster Island, we are dressed appropriately. You know what they say, keep your ankles warm and your whole body stays hot. Look at that tiny little fire. <laughs> My word, it's rather chilly. Glad to see you made it safe and sound. Very few have ventured to the Alabaster Icelands. Apart from Tahua, living in the odd supply core from excursion to gather materials. But the survey cars, of course, must go anywhere the Pokemon are found. From what I gather, Ice Pick Arena, where you'll find Avalog. It's rather far off, I'm afraid. Doubtless, this mission to tackle Avalog will be another dangerous one. Learn all that you can from here to Anatomy and try to keep yourself safe. All right, see ya. Oh, look, it's Irida. <clears throat> An Adamin. How, aren't you freezing? Freezing, I'm practically sweating. Beach weather out here, Adamin. Beach weather, you think it's bad? Just wait, this is nothing compared to where we're headed. <clears throat> you know, beginning to think the problem between this isn't a Diamond Clan or a Pearl Clan thing. It's just a you and me thing. We'll never see eye to eye on anything, will we? I don't see how we could, as long as you and your clan cling to your vision of an almighty Sinnoh that reigns over time. Forgive my bluntness, but if such a being even does exist, it's certainly not almighty Sinnoh. Yes, yes. Believe what you want. Just tell us where we have to go. We're headed to see my teacher, and he's only ever found in one place. Which is? You're talking about that Garrick fellow, right? Where do we find him? 
<laughs> and Avalog's legacy, obviously. Where else but a great mass of ice could have meant what I said when we headed somewhere even colder. Jeez, oh, duh, Adamant. Yeah, I'm ready to go, all right? It feels like maybe I should have a fire Pokemon to fight the Avalog, right? <laughs> so I can't stand people who only care about weather. Time is passing by them. See you at Avalog's legacy, Jay. Take care on your way. All right, see you later, bye. Ooh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Let's see. Go meet Garrick of the Pearl Clan. All right, so right out of the gate, we got something maybe we can catch. Let's get it, Snow Runt. Snow Runt. Going down, Snow Runt. Bam, right there. Catch, hopefully. One. Dunk. We got him, just like that. May as well go ahead and mark that on the map, eh? Uh, Pokeball? All right, we got it. We are dressed for the occasion. Yes, we are. Oh, we actually should get this. Uh, because, ooh, look at that. Ice tunnel, that's interesting. Should we go in? Should we go in? Should we go in? Maybe, oh. Catch it. Oh, we didn't get it. It's annoying. Snowball? What are you gonna do with the snowball? Crevasse Passage. Iron Chunk? That doesn't get us any experience, unfortunately. The Crevice Passage. All right, no big deal. Let's see, ooh, ooh, Bergmite, Bergmite, okay. Oh, another one, okay. All right, there's two in here. Let's see if we can get one. Or maybe both. Maybe as long as they don't attack us, we should be good. Oh, what a miss! Oh, man! All right. Let's go ahead and fight it, I guess. Bergmite. Now, this is cool, because there is um, Hisuian Avalug as well. So, could potentially be good. Bergmite, gotcha. Easy peasy. Oh, that one's not looking. Wait, what sees us? That? Oh. All right, Rotera, get out there. Do another thing. We're gonna forget these Bergmite. I love how Rotera like glows in the dark with that yellow in this game, though. It's so cool. Feed a Bergmite. Yep, two down. Gonna have to go here. Let Barb get all the free. Got a space in our item for that, space in our satchel for that. It's not good. Should have cleared that out before we went adventuring, I suppose. But free experience, all the same. Let Barb go out there. Oh, Barb leveled up! Hooray! Just from smashing rocks. Move mastered. I wonder what it was. Not like we've been using any attacks, but whatever. We'll take it. We'll take it. Now we're out here. Sneezler. Okay, so we didn't catch any Bergmites. This looks like a new area, right? Another Snorunt over here, so we can just easily snatch that up. It looks like it's just chilling. <laughs> Get it. Because it's cold. It's wearing like a coat. Got it. Okay, right down there, right in that hole, I'm pretty sure is where you catch the um, Zoroarks, or the Zorua, anyway. Oh, Pillow Swine, Pillow Swine, very good. Bone Chill Wastes, indeed. All right, let's get another Schnorra. May as well just keep catching these because they're easy and just free points towards our next uh, mastery thing, right? Get it? Question is, can we... Can we Sneasler down into this thing? Or do you have to like fly down? I don't know. No, well, we're down. All right, here we go, here we go. All right, first of all, we're gonna have to clear it out. I, I remember doing this before. It is tricky. Oh, shiny stone, that feels good. Oh, don't have room, as if, dude. 
Uh, let's go ahead and EXP Candy on, I guess, Barb, right? Uh, uh, maybe Humphreys is the better one. Humphreys leveled up! All right, let's go ahead and EXP Candy Humphreys again. All right, that was nothing. We can probably discard these. We can probably discard this. We can use this for sure on Humphreys here. Uh, we'll cruise attack. Let's go ahead and use all these on Humphreys. Get that HP up, get that HP up, get that HP up, get that defense up. And now we have some room. All right, that's fantastic. Shiny stone. Here we go. All right, ooh, there's the mischievous and the ghastly. So we're gonna have to clear out some spaces down here. We don't wanna catch these guys, we just wanna clear them out so they're not in our way. Yeah, this guy's going down. We're just gonna give it the old crunch. Ready, crunch! Yeah, you're dead. And then I wanna say, it's possibly right down there. Okay, you have to be very careful though, we have to be very careful. We don't want it, I think because there's like one at a time, so we don't want to lose it. I'm pretty sure it's down here though. There it is, okay, okay. We have to get rid of that ghastly, first of all. We don't want the Zoroa to run. Okay, first things first, get rid of the ghastly. It's going down. All right, don't run, don't run, little Zora. Don't run. Get rid of the ghastly so we don't have any competition over here. And then we're gonna use our um, smoke bomb to sneak up real close on that thing. Crunch this guy, you got him, Luisa. Yes, beautiful, beautiful. Excellent. All right, we're gonna get our, do we have a smoke bomb? We do, okay. And then we're just gonna try and get right behind it and go great ball on it. Or maybe we should just try and battle it. Nah, I think this is better. All right, turn around, turn around, turn around. Let's go! Come on, come on! Oh, just like that! The Zora one, yeah! That's so cool! <laughs> oh man, how exciting, how exciting. I love that Pokemon of this generation. It's so cool, the white and the pink. Oh man, freaking excellent. What a fun catch, what a fun catch. And I'm looking at the clock. That looks like probably a good spot to end. We went on our quest, we caught exactly what we wanted to. We got an alpha today, a long awaited uh, catch with the uh, with the Drapion. Oh my gosh. Um, <clears throat> all right, next episode, we are going to one, name our Zorua. Two, we're gonna figure out if we can use our Drapion. And uh, yeah, then we shall, we shall continue on. But as ever, thank you so much for joining us today. Maybe next time we'll try and fight the next noble Pokemon. That would be crazy. Seems like we just did a fight. Oh my goodness, hey, look, we're cold. Oh no. Don't get cold, little Jay. It's all right, we'll take care of you. Anyway, uh, thanks for watching so much. Don't forget to hit that like button if you haven't already. Uh, subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any future updates and make sure you leave a comment so we might name a Pokemon after you. But otherwise, until next time, bye! And before we go, I want to give a huge shout out to all of our amazing supporters over on Patreon. I used to be able to read out every single person's name, but you guys have been so awesome and so many people have joined that I, I don't think I have the time to read out every single name anymore, but big, big, Thank you to every single person who's supporting us over there. If you'd like to see your name on this wall, or if you'd like to take part in our other show on this channel, Box Breakers, where we open Pokemon cards and then send them to you guys, you can head over to patreon.com slash supercarlingaming. Thanks again, everyone. Dead spork.